Coming up, you're gonna discover how to A-B test your app icon on Google Play and how doing so can lead to more downloads. Stay tuned. What is up, App Nation? It is Steve P. Young, founder of AppMasters.co, the place you go when you want action-packed content in the app marketing business. And today, I want to show you how to actually A-B test, live A-B test on Google Play. One of our previous clients where we helped design a brand new icon for him, we actually increased his downloads by 90% just with a simple icon change changing nothing else but a different icon led to 19% more downloads. I've heard people say 50%. I've heard people say 100%. And if you watch my previous videos where I dis where I tell you the number one mistake that most people make for an Apple feature, it is design. And an app icon is a very, 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 critical to your app success. So today I'm gonna to show you how to actually do it on Google Play. Let's get to it. Here is the Google Play console. This is where your, all your apps are gonna be listed. I'm gonna blur out the apps that we have going on right now, just to not expose any data, but I'm gonna go through the exact process anyways. So go ahead and click into your app that you wanna A-B test. You might have multiple, but go ahead and click into that. And then you wanna go into here, store presence and store listing experiments. Okay. So I'm gonna click that. And now you can actually figure out which one you want to test. So this is just global, which is graphics. So you can gr experiment with graphic assets in your store listings. This would be screenshots, this would be app icons, feature image, things like that. And then for a localized version, you can do both meaning you can do text and graphics. So you can say, hey, I wanna run an English test for US English and then test out graphics along with the app's description. Change that around to see which one will perform better. I'm gonna actually focus just on graphics here. So I'm gonna click that. And then you can name your experiment. So I'm gonna call this app icon test. And here, as you can see, you can do the feature graphic, you can do screenshots, and you can A-B test promo video. I'm actually just gonna focus on the high-res icon. Now, I have heard from past clients of mine who've actually A-B tested screenshots too, and that has seen a lift in downloads. And so I would say probably start with the app icon, first and foremost, and then move on into the screenshots to A-B test that a little bit more. That's what I would personally do. So that's what I'm going to do right now. I'm going to do that. And then I'm going to put new app icon. Cool. I'm going to hit OK on this. And now here is where you can see your current icon. And then here's where you want to put your new icon. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. I'm going to upload that. And boom, I've got it. Cool. And that's it. So all you got to do is hit run experiment because that's all we're A-B testing. Boom. And then you get to see in this, in this bar right here, in the graph right here, and you get to see in this bar right here, the statistics, what the current one is doing, how the new app icon is performing and so forth. And then you can easily apply this new app icon if you wanna keep that icon moving forward. So this is where you start it. You let it go. We've seen some really good results. I would definitely say A-B test your app icons and then A-B test your screenshots. Let me know how it goes for your end. If you like this video, like it, thumbs up, and then don't forget to hit subscribe. And the last thing is there's an event that we have coming up called App Masters Connect in September 2017. It's happening September 13th and 14th in beautiful Santa Cruz. If you're not familiar with California, it is in the Bay Area. It's far enough that you have you can that you can't just go back for a lunch meeting, but it's close enough that you can easily drive there. It's about an hour away. 
maybe 60 miles away from San Francisco and all the major Bay Area cities. But is that one of the proudest things that I've ever done? You know, I'm all a believer in community. That's how I got my start. I started a podcast, built an audience, audience started coming to me. And now I get to run a business where I help startups, indies, big companies with their app marketing. And I'm a firm believer in this. And so that's why I'm doing this event. It is all around building lasting connections with everybody that's there from the speakers to the attendees to everyone there and all the people that have already signed up so we're about halfway sold as of this recording all the people there that are coming are really phenomenal people who have made it in the app space they've got some really great knowledge it's not just people who are higher ups and the execs these are a lot of the indie guys really making it in the space who really know their stuff and i'm super proud to have what a handful, I would say probably like six or seven people from Vegas from our first event coming back to Santa Cruz. That's when you know you've got a good event, when you get returnees coming back. And so I'm super excited to be doing this. I hope to see you there. It is at mastersconnect.com, at mastersconnect.com. Tickets will sell out. So make sure you buy yours buy yours soon, okay? At mastersconnect.com. Be there. It's going to be a phenomenal event. We're all going to really, really get to know each other and hopefully build these connections that last years beyond this one event. All right, guys. Hope to see you soon. Don't forget to hit subscribe to that YouTube channel. All right? See ya.